Hello, and welcome to AMS 2's King of Buscarud. And today, we are in the P4 class to see if they can be crowned king. So today, we start things off in the MCR 2000. This is a Welsh-built lightweight sports car with a 2-litre Ford Duratec naturally aspirated engine at its heart. It's a nice, nimble car, very easy to get to grips with, and makes a great companion to this Buscarud kart track. I find the individual P4 cars very nice and very enjoyable to drive, however I do find a bit frustrating when racing them together, depending on the circuit, one car will come out well above the other, which I prefer a class where they're more evenly balanced. But anyway, the MCR 2000 is making easy work of these quicker parts of the Buscarud kart track and is hopping across those curbs with relatively little problem. A little bit of back end wiggle going through boulders, coming up into the brow before we turn right onto the wind farm to see the final lap time of a 108.959. Here we are now into the Metal Moral MRX Duratec P4, a similar 2 litre naturally aspirated Ford Duratec engine in this car, but it does produce more power and has slightly more torque. Going through the first sector and the Metal Moro is slightly ahead, although I suspect being a slightly longer wheelbase and a slightly heavier car through the more nimble parts of the track, the MCR has a potential to catch up. Coming out of 180 going into the forest, things look relatively even, although a bit of a slide coming out of the forest may have cost Metal Moro a bit more time than I thought as it seems to be falling away slightly. Coming down Cascades, a little bit of a traction issue at the top there, but the Metal Moro is now on its way through the estate into Renato. Hopping over those curbs, taking a little bit more liberty than the MCR was doing. Going through Boulder definitely appears to be a little slower on these slightly more tricky sections of the circuit. And it does appear that the MCR has taken it with a six tenths of a second lead. Now let's have a look at the leaderboard with the P4 cars slotting in right behind the Formula Trainer. The MCR only three tenths of a second off top spot here and both of the P4s beating the P3 Rocco, which is the first of the major upsets, I believe, of King of Buscarud. Don't forget to keep an eye out for the episodes coming up in the near future where we start diving into how the GT cars get to challenge to become the king of Buscarud.